So one of the greatest snack foods has quite the history here in the United States, so much so, as a matter of fact, that it has its own museum and its own holiday. Oh, yeah. We are talking about pretzels. And tomorrow is National Pretzel Day, so joining us today to show us a couple different things we can do with pretzels is Pam Ward, owner of Twisted Pretzel Bakery here in Salisbury. Thank, Thank you. you for coming in. Thanks. Let me tell you, I love, love, she loves her love pretzels so so what are we gonna do here with these we're juggling pretzels. we can make pretzels sweet or savory yeah so we have both today we're okay. gonna do some cinnamon pretzels uh-huh so we weigh out our dough okay. and we have a certain spot so it's like when you were a kid right. playing with play-doh <laughs> did it. you ever see what I did with play-doh <laughs> So you roll it out. So I guess I ought to have that for like yep. pretty much the, okay. And the dough that you're using. <laughs> I don't think I did that right. Something tells me that's not right. It could have been close. <laughs> it might have been close. The dough that you're using, it's a, it's a specific pretzel dough? It's, uh, no, no, it's not. It's yeast water and, uh, Flour. Flour. Oh, okay. Yep. So, very basic recipe. So, All right. Are you, are you supposed to tie them in knots like Jimmy's doing right there? Well, you can. <laughs> we, we usually let the kids that come to the shop do that <laughs> any way they want. Okay. But, but the real, that said a lot right there, didn't it? The real way is. The real uh, way. Okay. Make a, like a U. Make a or U. Or a smiley face. Smiley face U. And then you U. can crisscross it. And then go over. And there's actually a history behind why it it, it is in that shape, right? There is. Um, it's something about a monk mm -hmm. and about prayer, where uh -huh. they cross their hands. The children cross their uh -huh. hands. Okay. Here, do something with it. All right, all right. So I want to do another one. So we have our. <laughs> she gave me a good one. <laughs> Got to make it a little bit longer, because if not, it'll be too much dough in the middle. Oh, oh. that might not so, be a good I didn't thing. Know that. Yeah. Okay. Why so I didn't I'm actually. Give you that tip, did I? <laughs> I'm going to set this down for a second, because I'm actually going to dip it. So I'm dipping it into the butter here. Yes, we've got okay. melted butter. Uh huh. And we have cinnamon and sugar on the side. So both you just, sides or just yes, okay. both sides. So you get it good. Okay, I love me some butter. And then you just put it in the cinnamon and sugar. Okay. Dip it in the cinnamon and sugar. Mm-hmm. Mine's not getting very long and thin here, Pam. Well, <laughs> sometimes you do have to put a little pressure on it. If I put a little pressure oh. on it, I'm going to push our counter all the way across the studio <laughs> here. You know what? You can make sticks. I can make sticks? You can yeah. make sticks. How's that one? There you go. Well, you have to cut them. <laughs> I thought but I did a pretty good stuff. We could right do there. little bite size. Okay. Nuggets. Nuggets. Yeah. Or we could do sticks. There's a little. I should have had the, the legendary little. llamas help me on this. That's what I should <laughs> Whoa, have done. Oh, they might have. Sure yeah. they would. They've done a lot so, better than me here. So you want to dip them? Dip them. Okay, so I'm going to dip our nuggets here into the butter. We'll finish this one off okay. and get it. I like the way you say we, Pam. <laughs> You're helping. That's always good. So I how many? Do you want to try to do the, the knot? So on a, any given day, how many pretzels do you end up rolling? Um, it depends. We make it every day. Mm -hmm. um, some days we'll go through 50, some days we'll do 20. Okay. Um, at the shop we do much more than pretzels, mm -hmm. so that's part of the reason. <laughs> we do crab pretzels, so we're going to make crab dip oh, okay. with, our, crab pretzels. with our pretzel sticks. So. Really? Okay. Uh -huh. So these are actually good. This, though, is, is going into the oven? This is going to bake. Yep. Okay. They okay. bake about eight minutes. Mm. And these are best when they come fresh out of the oven. Ooh. Like how I'm pushing you along. Yeah. <laughs> You've seen us work in the kitchen before, have you? <laughs> you know how we do this, don't you? Right. <laughs> Jimmy, what you doing there? You gonna try I'm, to twist I'm gonna again? make a shoestring. Watch You're this. You're making one. a shoestring. Do you want to make a pretzel roll? A pretzel roll? Yes. Sure. We, I haven't we, mastered anything else yet, so you might want to show me something new. We make sandwiches okay. with pretzel rolls. Oh, Get out of town. Yeah. Look at that. I like that. And wow. Then, then we slice them in half and put chicken salad or turkey or roast beef. That sounds good. So. Wow. All right. This All one right, we so could put one. vanilla icing yeah. on or something. I worked hard on that one, Lisa. Okay. 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 So I'm not going to put any sugar on that. I'm just going to put it in here. Okay. Okay. So we're going to put those in the oven how for long? how yeah. long? At what? Eight minutes. Eight minutes. 450. 450. I got 266. I'm getting there. <laughs> we'll right. be good. Okay, so you're going to help me make some. See, he did all the fun part with yeah. the, with the rolling and everything. He'll get to do the dishes. <laughs> and he gets to do the dishes. <laughs> um, we're going to start on some, uh, I guess, toppings. It's the crab dip. Crab dip, okay. Um, we take the cream cheese. All of this? All of oh, it. Oh, boy. It's yummy. We <laughs> <laughs> need a cup of the sour cream. A cup of sour cream. Looks like that's almost a cup right there. I saw that, Jimmy. So what? <laughs> He's still in the pretzels. All right, feeling nothing. All right. And then we need the, it's a cup of mayonnaise. You can put the whole thing Get in. Get the whole thing in. Yeah. Okay. 
and do this those first. Are those all measured? Yes, okay, it's a so tablespoon of parsley. Parsley. We have Old Bay. Old Bay. Mm -hmm. Mm -mm. And Worcestershire. Sure, sure, sure. And Worcestershire. <laughs> Worcestershire, sure, 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 as she said. Spell it. <laughs> nope. <laughs> okay. okay. So gonna... we would mix that in the mixer. In the mixer. And then we would add our cheese and our crab dip at the end. So okay. you fold it in. Okay. But so I already gonna... made some, so you can oh, try okay. it. Oh, okay. So we're just going to put those oh. over there. So. Okay. So, so this is some pretzels we made this morning. Mm hmm These are the pretzel rolls that we talked about. Yeah. Where you can cut them in half and put, people get them and put hamburgers on them mm -hmm. for the mm -hmm. summer. And they're, they're thick, so they um, hold up really well. Of course, we have our regular traditional pretzels with salt. We have some people that get them without salt. And we've made the sticks, which the sticks is what we make our crab pretzel with. We put the four sticks on the bottom and pour the hot crab dip over the top. Really? And uh, eat yes. it up. So what's, what are some unusual toppings? Do people come in and it's like, I want, I don't know, horseradish on mine or anything like that? They like spicy mustard and horseradish on their sandwiches, roast beef. Uh-huh. Um, we do poppy seed. Okay. Some people like garlic and poppy seed on their pretzels. Mm -hmm. um, we've had people want chocolate drizzled on them. I like we'll do pretzel sticks and just drizzle them with chocolate and put them on a platter for a party. All right. Well, I tell um, you what, Pam, we are going to finish this up. We still have our pretzels in the oven. Don't go anywhere. You are watching Delmarva Life. <laughs>